How's it going everyone, it's Nintendo64 also here and I decided to do a little bit different. Today I'm going to show you my DVD and Blu-ray um, collection as of um, December 2023. Um, now, the reason why I'm doing this is uh, because I own a lot of DVDs and a few Blu-rays that I have, so... Without any further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start off with disc only game or, or, or movies. So, alright, first one up is Shrek, Smurfs 2, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows, if this can focus. Then Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the 2014 movie. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the final chapters, this too. And there's another copy of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Um, <coughs> now we have the old, now this is a burnt um, disc. This is actually, um, I don't know, I don't know what this is. Uh, I think it's like... Yeah, I don't know what this is. So, random. And Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. Minions. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Super Shredder Disc 1. And 3. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles The Final Chapters Disc 1. And another copy of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So, I have Three copies of the 2014 movie. And here's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The uh, Wanted. Beep Bop and Rock Steady. Here's Paw Patrol. And here's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The Complete Final Season. The 1987 show. And these are, all, that's all the loose discs. Now we're getting to the, these ones. First one up is Shrek 2. Spanglish. Oh, here's another loose disc. Christmas Vacation. Here is the Laugh Out Loud with 51st Dates and Adam Sandler Big Daddy. All in one disc. Far and away. Here's Spider Man, Spider Man 2, and Spider Man 3. I don't have the Spider Man 3 disc anymore, so I just have the first movie and the second movie, and that's it. We have role models. That's the first stack. Now the second, whoops, here's the fifth element. Um, what can I say about this one? It's a really good movie. Not all, I um, mean, overall, it's just a very weird movie, to be honest. Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Uh, god dang it. Can't even, oh yeah, because I have to open these things. God, I'm so stupid. But, what can I say? It's just a really good movie. To be quite honest, I haven't watched it that much, but oh, I don't even watch movies that much. I would like, rather watch some shows. That I actually cared about. Here's the campaign with the um. I really like that cover art. Here's another loose disc, old dogs. Uh, if you're gonna get uh, if you're gonna get um old dogs, I would highly recommend you you get on 4K HD. I don't know when. And on Blu-ray. But don't get this DVD one. That 
that movie can go screw itself up. Here's 300. I also have it on Blu-ray, which I will show you that in a minute. Here's Star Wars 2 Attack of the Clones. This is the one that is incomplete. This one houses uh, this... Uh, what, what is this? Disc 1. But... I've been trying to look everywhere to find uh, Disc 2. But we are... I think we originally had this... I don't know... Uh, I'm not even gonna ask. I'm, I'm looking forward to get disc two of this soon. So I can complete the whole thing. And add that disc to, uh, so I can put it in that case. Happy Gilmore. Um, yeah. This movie is just very weird and very, you know. Um, in interesting. Here's uh, four Harry Potter films. We got if this can focus. Here's the Sorcerer's Stone, the Chamber of Secrets, the Prisoner of Azkaban, and here is the Goblet of Fire. If you're, but here it is. This one, this one is actually the half flood price. It, it, we don't. I don't think we have the, uh, um, the disc for the. Uh, let me see here. Got the Sorcerer's Stone, the Prisoner of Azkaban, and the, uh, uh, Goblet of Fire. So I don't even know. I, okay. Don't ask me why why that dis why that wrong um incomplete disc is in there. I just got it that way. But we don't have the chamber of secrets. We just have these three that actually came with it. So I'm looking forward to get this game. Wh what the frick movie complete and get a loose disc for the chamber of secrets. Here is the Pink Panther. Not that bad. Michael Collins. Swordfish. Almost Famous. Very weird movie, to be honest. Here's the Rainmaker. I don't... I don't think I have the... This for the Rainmaker. I actually have. If I can. Uh, oh, hold on a minute. Because I have to open it like this. Um, I really hate these cases. I wish they were normal. This is. Oh, yeah, it is the Rainmaker. My bad. I'm getting that. Um. Mistaken with that next movie I'm going to show that is incomplete. So there's that. The Miracle on 34th Street. Really good movie. Georgia Roll. This blank case. It, this blank case has a happy feet. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's actually a blockbuster. DVD rental case. Well, what else do we have left? Um, right, go chat. And the Godfather 3 movie collection, which has all these three discs. Oh, losing focus. Uh, March at the Pink. Whoops. I don't know why is he so slippery, but here's March of the Penguins, another uh, really good movie. I definitely recommend it. The Transporter. I, I don't think I actually have the disc for the, this movie. I actually have the hitch. I want to get it complete. I want to get this movie complete and get a loose disc of this, because... 
it's just weird not having the disc for this and not ha having the disc for any of my other games that are incomplete. Here's Fight Club. Hairspray. This one comes in a white DVD case. You don't actually see that too often. Here is um, Triple Features, the 40-year-old version, Knocked Up, and for Gaining Sarah Marshall. I believe this has, these are the multi-disc um, movies. Here is Knocked Up. Here is the 40-year-old version for Gaining Sarah Marshall. So, I never even heard about this until I actually brought it and... I was like, I gotta have this. This one doesn't have a cover art, but this one is actually another burnt disc. This one is Batman. <coughs> Here is Pineapple Express. Really good as well. Fear of Loafing in Las Vegas. This one is actually also good. This one's also good. I definitely recommend this one. And the last two are the Sideways. This is actually the last DVD I actually have. But this one is actually a CD. This is Curtain Call. From that album from I think around the 2000s but but this CD actually still works and it might have scratches but still works we'll just put that over here but that's all of the DVDs I oh crap let's just move this box out of the way and go away now, let's just put this, um, let me put my, let me put my phone down, and let's just put these, um, over here. Oh, oh god, I'm making a mess, but let's just put them in, oh, Jesus Christ. Um, here is, uh, let me, let me just put them in the right r right way they're supposed to and let's just leave these right here and put this get that right here and now let's show off the blue lays that I have there I believe they're alphabetical order so I have 300 this movie is really good get it either on DVD or blu-ray or on 4k ultra HD I mean wherever you want to get it's still a good one Here's I Am Legend. This movie is also really good. And next up is The Lord of the Rings. The, uh, what is it? The Two Towers. This one actually comes with, a, uh, I think, a code and uh, two discs that are supposed to be in there. So that's complete. And here is another Lord of the Rings movie. This is actually the Return of the King. This one doesn't come with the code, but you still got your two discs that are supposed to be. Whoops! There's a supposed to be in there. Very, very freaking awesome. Here's Moana. I'm not going to lie, you. This get this movie. Freaky uh, sucks. I mean, I I freaking hate this movie. If you're if you're going to get a Disney movie, get whatever Disney movie you want to get. Stay away from this. Stay away from this garbage. Stay away from this stupid piece of crap. It's not worth it. Then next up is another worse one. This is complete garbage. This is. Uh, Peter Pan returns to Neverland, and I. What I, what I gotta say is, I would give it a zero out of ten because this this movie is just god awful. 
but here's you got your code and you got your DVD and Blu-ray disc. So, um, there's that. Yeah, stay away. Yeah, stay away from this uh piece of crap. Piece of crap tune. These two are do the water. That. Those movies can go screw itself up as well. Here's Suicide Squad Extended Cut. Um, really good, really good. I actually liked it, but I haven't even watched it that much since I'm more into like other movies. And the final one, The Dark Knight. I'm planning to get The Dark Knight Rises really soon, so stay tuned for that. Here's the first disc. You get your what is it? Uh, yeah, the digital copy, and you got this, and you get the special features. That's basically it. So, that is everything that I have. The DVDs and the Blu-rays, and that one freaking CD over there. That's complete. I don't even know. But, before I, uh, before I end this, I want to show you the, uh, player that I have. So, um, here is this one, and this Philips one. This LG, actually, I don't know, we actually have this, we actually had this for years, and this is the, I, th I, th I think it's the new one, I believe, but this one plays Blu-rays and DVD. This one plays DVD, so I guess it's a DVD player. This one, let me turn the flashlight on, you guys can see it, because it's like, um, on top of my PS4, but... This one's also a DVD player because I have two DVD players and one Blu-ray player. So that is everything that I have right now. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more game ga game collection videos or more videos on this channel. I'm planning to get more movies soon. If you actually like movies that much, then whatever. Just go buy some on your own, I guess. So hope you all enjoy. I'll see you all in the next one, and, um, laters.